And now let's head over to Chief Meteorologist Mike Nelson, who is tracking the forecast tonight. Mike, how are we looking? Gary, if you want to head up and ski tomorrow, you're going to be a very windy day. You will have some fresh snow, but the winds will be blowing at least 50 miles per hour. For this evening, the winds have lightened up temporarily, and it's pretty nice out there. 55 degrees at 7 o'clock, it'll be about 48 by 11 p.m. Today, the temperature bounced up to 64 degrees, which is well above the average high of 53, but shy of the record of 75 back in 19. 99. Right now it's 58 downtown, 54 at DI. Skies are clear. Pressure's falling ahead of a storm system, and the winds are out of the west southwest at 6. This is what it looked like up on the Continental Divide this afternoon, looking west from the Loveland ski area, and that some of those clouds coming in in advance of this approaching cold front that's going to bring wind and snow to the mountains. Warm and windy conditions ahead of it, colder air coming in behind it. Tonight, that front marches into the state, the snow develops in the mountains, and we could see about four to eight inches of snow over much of the high country. By morning, it's windy and mild in the plains, a few showers out in Nebraska and Kansas. The morning low temperatures will stay in the 30s to around 40 on the plains, Teens and 20s expected in the mountains along the Front Range. 18 degrees, very windy at Winter Park by morning. 20 and windy at Keystone, about 38 in Denver, 40 at Highlands Ranch and Broomfield. So a few rain showers are possible on the plains, but this is basically a mountain system. Heavy snow, very windy there. By midday, strong northwest winds across much of the state. Snow showers will linger in the mountains, and later in the afternoon, those winds will start to drop off a little, but it won't be until evening that they really calm down. Temperatures much cooler tomorrow with the pass of this front, and look at the snow. Four to eight inches central and northern mountains, three to six in the southwest. Little precip, but just the strong winds on the plains where temperatures drop back into the 40s for the Denver area. Still some low 60s southeast in the mountains. The temperatures are just going to be in the 20s and 30s. And with that wind, it's going to feel really cold. So a different day on the way for tomorrow. Absolutely. Tonight, it's going to be partly cloudy, becoming windy. Southwest winds will pick up later, 35 for a low. Tomorrow, a very windy day. Mountains get snow. Winds from the northwest 25 to 50 miles per hour and the high only at 45. Now in the extended forecast, things get great. Sunday is going to be mostly sunny, not as windy, 55. Monday, 62. Look at Tuesday and Wednesday, low 70s expected. Next Thursday, upper 60s. Next storm system begins to approach next Friday. The clouds increase, the temperatures cool a bit with highs in the low 50s. Hang on tomorrow, though. The strong winds will be whipping across the state. All right, Mike.